Hi everyone, it's Crafty Karen, back again with another book haul. Uh, this is the Hashtag Friday book haul open collaboration with Nat Williams. Now, I'll be posting this a day late, so uh, this will be Saturday that you're getting it. Um, I've had a pretty hectic week and also I rearranged my craft room around and did a lot of sorting out which is always scary when you sort your craft room out because then you realise how much stuff you've collected. <laughs> okay, we'll start off with this World Atlas. I, I liked it because of the map pages in it. So, and this one's a copyright 1971. So I'll just do a quick flip through of this. I hope you can focus because it's quite sunny. It's been a very hot week this week and I don't cope very well on the heat. Uh, hence that's why I moved from Queensland um, down south. Okay, lovely colours on this pages. Um, even the index pages I'll use because they're a lovely matte colour. Matte and a nice colour on them. But um, great maps in there to use as pages or collaging. So that's that one. The next one is the story of the car. I don't normally look for these type of books, but um, this one had some nice vintage pictures in it. Lovely blue cover on this. And this one is, oh, 1974. So some lovely old illustrations in here. Lots of black and white, but there are some colour plates in here as well. Hopefully it's coming up bright enough for you. So I'm not using any lights today. This one looks like a, a fancy big pram. <laughs> but. So, yes, got it. Mainly because it had a lot of vintage cars in here. That's a great picture, that one there. I could see that using that one in one of my collages. <laughs> But the cars go all the way up to the 70s. And there's a there's that one. Beautiful colour to that cover too. Okay. A another Beatrice Potter.
This one's 1984. Shelley Barber fairy book, an anthology of this. This one, 1997. She's not that old, but. Fairy and folk, folk towels. And this one's nineteen eighty six. Nice matte pages in this one. Oh, God. Bit scary. Gorgeous. Death's Godson. Lovely children's story. <laughs> oh dear. Some of those um, old folk tales were quite scary. So that's that one. This one's The Lion in the North. 1,000 Years of Scotland History. This had a lovely cover. A not too big either, so I'll probably use that as a, a journal cover. Nice old relic. Looks nice. This one is nineteen seventy one. That one, I'm getting hot in here now. I turned the aircon off so it wouldn't be too noisy, and now I'm getting hot. <laughs> a book of dogs, a Reader's Digest book of dogs, and a lot of dogs. This one's copyright 1984, and I like this one because they're um, drawn illustrations. History and 
then start with the, all the lovely pictures I have. I hope everyone's had a lovely week. Um, like I said, it's been really quite warm here. It's at these moments, I wish I was in the north somewhere where it's snowing. Um, because I don't cope. I knew it was going to be really hot today um, because South Australia got it yesterday. I think they got up to 37 degrees Celsius. So very hot for those living in South Australia. And now it's hit us. What on earth are you wearing? This is a fairly new book and it's probably one I won't cut up. Um, I got it for the um, inspiration with the colours and mark making. Like the watercolour pictures in here are lovely. I should play around with my watercolours more, but every time I use them, they just don't look like that. <laughs> so maybe it's the paper I'm using. So that one there, this is a little girl on my bookshelf. Uh, the Country Life Book of Nursery Rhymes. Lovely um, cloth feel to this one. It'll make a nice cover. Scholastics Lucky's lettering book. This wouldn't be very old either. Mm. 1993. But I liked all the font in there. it is a very short one and I'm hoping it's better late than never and um, I'm thinking I probably won't do a, a Friday book haul this Friday as it's New Year's Eve so it'll probably be the week after that I post something to do with a book haul. Um, I'm actually going to try and pop a video on sometime during this week of doing something else and um, 
But if I don't catch up with you again, I hope everyone has um, happy holidays and um, enjoy the break, uh, even with everything that's going on in the world. Um, I wish you all health and happiness and love. Okay, until next time. Bye. And don't forget to hit the thumbs up and hit the subscribe button.